60 Minutes reported that, and it is false. And that's why since then I have asked the people who made those claims, two individuals in particular made those claims, tell us who those priests are. Bishop Richard Malone speaking for the very first time live on the radio tonight, responding to a statement made by one of the whistleblowers interviewed by 60 Minutes. Well, it was Father Bob Ziliox of St. Mary's in Swarmville who said there are eight or nine men still in priesthood here in Buffalo that have been accused of sex abuse. Now, what he didn't say, which had an awful lot of Catholics concerned, was whether they were still in active ministry or not. So the question now is who and where are these men? Two on your side, investigative reporter Steve Brown digs deeper in this Two on Your Side original. Who are they? Who are the priests that Father Robert Ziliox was talking about when he told 60 Minutes there are area priests who should be removed from the priesthood? I would argue at least eight or nine. How many of them still are in the priesthood here in Buffalo? All of them. Ziliox is in a unique position to make that assessment. He was a diocesan canon lawyer who reviewed priest abuse cases. The diocesan spokeswoman says since the 60 Minute story aired, they have fielded phone calls from people worried about the charge from Ziliox. We're told priests themselves are concerned too. They said when people look at us, they wonder if we're one of those eight or nine. The diocese denies the claim, but in an interesting way, quote, we are not aware of any priests in active ministry who have allegations against them. The news release also points to Siobhan O'Connor's attorney, Mitchell Garabedian. Bishop Malone should be out here talking today. The diocese attributes to Garabedian a similar quote that eight or nine accused priests are still working. But is that what Ziliox meant? The answer is no. On Thursday, I spoke with Ziliox at length, most of it off the record at his request. But Ziliox wanted two on your side to share this about his eight or nine priests assertion. Quote, I asked people to read the transcript of my interview on 60 Minutes. I stand by what I said. He adds, I never said these eight or nine priests are in active ministry. And we think Ziliox is correct. We checked the 60 Minutes video. He never said the eight or nine priests were active in ministry. Okay, then where are they? A couple of possibilities here. They could already be suspended, or as the diocese says, on administrative leave. They could also be retired. We asked Father Ziliox who exactly are these eight or nine priests. He declined to name them at this time. Mary Alice. And I know that this is a concern for a lot of Catholics. Again, to sure. make this clear, these are eight or nine priests who are not actively working in parishes. That's what we think at this particular time. Father Ziliox on the record remarks were in response to our trying to get answers for concerned parishioners wondering if their priest is one of this eight or nine. Ziliox understood that concern and I believe he wanted to end that portion of the speculation. We do not know their names yet but we feel confident saying that these are not the priests that Catholics are seeing at Mass every Sunday. But they could be doing other things in the diocese. We know that there are other priests working uh, in the Catholic Center. They could be still throughout Western New York, but just not running a parish. Or suspended or retired, but not somebody that necessarily, based on description, somebody necessarily that someone would see at a Catholic parish. All righty, very good. Thank you very much for clearing that up, Steve. Sure thing.